Shani Cole and welcome to my channel Handbags and Happiness. I make videos with good information to help you buy things that make you happy, specifically handbags. If you like this kind of content, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I would greatly appreciate it. For today's video, we're going to be talking about the bags that are on Oprah's favorite things list. We all love Miss Oprah and every year she comes out with a list of her favorite things that she likes personally and that she also likes to give as gifts. So I went through the list as I do every year and I picked out a few things that I like. I wasn't really that into this year's list. I don't know, it was kind of low, low energy, low key to me. But she did have a few bags on her list that I thought, okay, let me look into and maybe I'll purchase, not for myself usually, but as a gift. So I want to talk about a couple of bags and then I have one of the bags to show you. So I will look down at my notes a little bit, but she has this Dare to Roam Prodigy book bag and the regular size comes in at $98 and the mini comes in at $72. This is made out of this special antimicrobial fabric that helps ward off bacteria. So in the age of C19, that is definitely something you might want for yourself or if you have kids that go to school, this might be a great backpack for them. It comes in eight colors and some of the colors are really bright like this bright yellow and bright pink. So if you're interested in a book bag, that's on the list this year. Then she has this crossbody utility with case and it's called the Billy Utility Crossbody with Case. And it basically is just a strap with a couple of pockets and at the end it's a cell phone case and you put your cell phone in it. And based on the description, it can hold like a lipstick, eyeliner, your keys, and your cell phone, that's it. It comes in three colors, gray, this cream color, and black, and it retails for $208. Moving on, she has one other handbag. Well, it's not really a handbag, it's a jewelry case. This is the Person Ultra Jewelry Case, and it retails for $54. It comes in nine different colors. It comes in red, fuchsia, green, there's like a animal print, gold. It comes in just tons and tons of colors. But the thing about it, it has two slip compartments and then it comes with eight, not eight, but 10 pouches that you can put your jewelry in and it's a travel bag. But this is a jewelry case that also doubles. You pull up the strap and it doubles as a handbag or evening bag, they say on the website. So if you want something that has multi-purpose, multi-function, this jewelry case can double, you can use it for travel, and then you can use it as an evening bag. And it holds your cell phone, so that's key. There are two other bags on the list, and they're both duffel bags. One is the Token and Carry Apollo One Extra Large Duffel Bag. This duffel bag is made of a snakeskin vegan leather. It's kind of on the pricey side of $200. And then she has the Sarah Jessica Parker Samsonite the Shuffle Convertible Duffel Bag, and that one's even pricier. That one's $300. Now, if you go on the list, and I will leave links to all the items down below, but if you go and look at the list, which I will always also link, um, if you buy from the retailer itself, a lot of them are giving like 10 to 20% discount, but you can also find all these items on Amazon.com. In my opinion, there was only one true bag on the list, and it came in at a great price point of $45. I think if you buy it from the website and not Amazon, I purchased from Amazon because I just want the prime shipping, you can get additional 25% off. So it is a vegan bag and it has no logo and it is called the K Carol Accessories Crossbody. And I was like, okay, this is a neat little thing. It's not the kind of bag I normally gravitate to, but I have a family member who is in need of a new handbag and she's not into logos, she's not into designers, she's not into anything too frilly or anything like that. She just wants a good handbag that functions as a handbag that she can carry every day. So I was thinking, let me get this bag, let me take a look at it, do a review of it, and if I like it, I'll give it to her as a gift. And so I'm completely opening this blind, it came today, two day shipping, actually it was one day shipping. And it offered me, like when I ordered it, Asked for me free same day shipping, but I was like, uh, oh, no, I'll just get it the next day. That's fine. So it came today, and and no special form or fashion. It just came in this little plastic Amazon 
bag and I have it open because I wanted to show you the packaging. So obviously for $45, I wasn't expecting much. And if I do give this to her as a gift, I will repackage it and put it in like a gift bag or box or something like that. Okay, so this is better than I expected. So it says the Kelsey Crossbody and it has the number on it. And then it does have the tag and it says design with RFID protected card holder. So that's good to know. It is a little, it's about the size I thought it was going to be. Maybe a little bit bigger. I was thinking it was going to be a little smaller for $45. Let's cut the tape. And it is wrapped in tissue. Okay. So it is much cuter than I thought it would be. And I chose it. It comes in tons and tons of colors. Um, camel, black, your standard colors, and then some reds and different things like that. But I was like, okay, it's the holidays and... Even though the person buying this for wants a no frill handbag, I thought, you know, let me try the plaid because at least it'll be a little something something. And there's so many different colors in the plaid. There's like this red, there's white, there's burgundy, there's green, there's blue, there's orange. And then the base of it is black. Like I said, it does have silver hardware. And I just thought with all these colors, you could definitely match this with a lot of different outfits. And another thing is, if I get it from Amazon, then they can, if they like it, they can exchange it for the color they like. So I like that because I think Amazon has like extended returns through the holidays. So the big thing about this bag is the organization. And I'm going to start on the back. So you have this little top handle and I think it's three inches is the drop. When I was watching the video back, I noticed that I forgot an important part. I didn't take the plastic off of the top handle strap. So I just want to take it off and show it to you, see how you can handle it. And it does fit like right here, but it won't go all the way to fit up to the crook of your arm. So it's more just a top handle. You open the back of it and it opens up like this. Okay. Tissue. Okay. So here's a strap, which I'll just put aside for a minute. And um, so inside this back part of the bag, there is a zip compartment, but it's really tight. I don't think you could fit anything like a lipstick or anything like that. Maybe just some bill, bills or cards. But this opens up pretty big, this compartment. And then on this side, you have a smaller compartment. You do have two card slots right there. So that's the back of the bag. Then we come around to the front. And you have this inside front pocket. And I like how this is gusseted where it opens up wide. I'm really actually impressed with the design of the bag. And the feel of it, it does feel like it has a nice texture to the vegan leather. It doesn't have any kind of smell or anything. So you open it up and you kind of have Okay, so this is all one compartment. So, oh, okay, the back compartment is not separate from the front compartment. So if I open the back up, this is all one compartment. So you have two compartments and you get into them. You can open it from the back or you can open them from the front. So I don't know if, I'll sh if you can see. Yeah, so it's not a separate back compartment and a separate front compartment. It's just one compartment. It has this divider in between. So the card slots that were on the back, you can also access them from opening it up the front. Yeah. Okay, so that's a different kind of design. Not what I was expecting, but oh, you can see right there, there's just this one divider. I guess that would be kind of easy access. You could open it from either side to get your items out. I, okay, that's really unique. Now let's do really quickly the phone test. I zipped it up. Let me tell you, the zipper is pretty good. It's just your standard zipper. Where is my phone? And I, I have the iPhone 13 Max Pro, and it does fit in the front. Let's open the back. Mm -hmm. 
So it says it fit in the front, it fit in the back. It does fit in the back. And let's one check it. Does not fit in the front compartment. Okay, here's the strap. And I don't think I'm gonna actually open the strap and do mod shots. I'll insert a picture of the person wearing it crossbody. But it is a 47 inch adjustable removable strap. The more I play with this bag, I definitely think I'm gonna give it to that family member. I'm gonna, you know, put in maybe a nice Christmas gift bag and I may add like a red or green card holder or maybe even a black card holder from Kate Spade or Michael Kors or something like that to add along with it so they can have, or maybe like a little small compact wallet. But I think I could make a really good gift out of this. I, I am slightly more impressed than I thought I would be. Well, that's all for this video about this bag. This is the K. Carroll Accessory Crossbody. I am more impressed. I love this plaid than I thought it would be. I mean, how? why did I doubt Miss Oprah? Why did I doubt Miss Winfrey? I should not have done that. This is definitely a great gift. Well, that's all for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Until the next video, be safe and be happy. And I also hope you're having a happy holiday season. Bye now.